trying to bring everything but the whole guy. Think we eat nothing but grass, what you talking about? I'm about to jump into the whip and hit the whole foods early. Get everything to get that soul food working. Like mac and cheese, the collard greens, the black eyed peas, and get a roast of that tofu turkey. Got cornbread, even got stuff. Mashed potatoes so good, put your hands in it. Stream beans, and you know we got yams with it. Got cap. So guys that's me just back from the vegan fete, I got this amazing easter egg from Considerate Chocolate, just look at that, it looks absolutely amazing, too good to eat. The other thing I got was from Mucklecoo, meltable garlic infused mozzarella style balls, as you can see it's all vegan, this is absolutely amazing guys, it melts so so good on pizzas and then obviously paninis and things like that as well. As well, I got this Glasgow Kinchy Company. They're absolutely amazing. I thoroughly recommend you go and check them out. But I say you can check them all out in their Facebook page, their Twitter, their Instagram, and then email as well. It's made with things like cabbage, carrot, onions, spring onions, garlic, and ginger and such like. Really, really good for your digestion, full of vitamins and great ferment as always fermented foods are really really good for you obviously from Cool Jet Vegan Pies I got the new spaghetti bolognese Cool Jet Vegan Pies are absolutely amazing guys Reels Pizza Slices 
I can't quite remember these. I think it's Auberginen and something. And this one's the Italian sausage and, and that that she does as well. One of the greatest pizza makers in the whole of Scotland. I love her pizzas. The vegan sweets guy, I actually got the strawberry macaroon, pe uh, the biscoff and the peanut butter one. Fudges there and that's macaroon. I got a Vigo bar. I also got the from Considerate Chocolate, the vegan cream eggs and obviously as well from uh, Quality Vitamins and Herbs I actually picked up some chocolate peanuts as well which are vegan also as well this new candle company that's actually out there doing a, a new vegan candles at the vegan fete she had actually rose and geranium so I picked up them but something that really stuck home to me was vegan sweets guy Jim he was talking to me and he actually said about a lot of people had complaining about them using plastic and such likes so he's actually started using this paper and things and it just really really struck home to me that I should probably start actually trying to limit down my plastic because I'm all about ethics I'm not as much about the environment but at the end of the day veganism's all about the animals, the people and the planet so I need to really start looking into things like zero waste trying to limit my, my carbon footprint and such likes and things as well guys so that's all my little haul guys I hope you like that I'm actually going to be going over to my mum's graveside tomorrow for the Mother's Day I will may take you with me there but that's a little vegan haul for today anyway some great great products I'll put the links for all the companies down below Reels Vegan Pizza Slices, Cool Jet Vegan Pies, The Glasgow Kimchi Company, Muckle Coo, Considerate Chocolate and obviously the Vegan Sweets guy as well guys. Speak to you all soon. So guys I'm down at my mum's graveside for Mother's Day and it's really really hard as you can see here there's a plaques down from my dad from his brothers. That's the one I originally put down for my mum and my dad. Still there, thank God. I've put down these tulips, I think they look absolutely lovely. Like I say, today's a really, really difficult day, guys, because it really, really hits me so, so much. And I see people out here with their mums and enjoying Mother's Day, and it just really hits home that my mum's no longer in this mortal realm, but she's in the next room, and I need to keep remembering that, that she's still there, and she's waiting for me, and I love her so, so much, and I fight every single day. To be half the person she was, she inspires me and I know that she would have been really proud of me what I've done. I've turned my life around for the slaughterhouse, for mating disorder depths, to be fighting for the animals and that's what I'm all about now and I think this is God's work and I think my mum would be really, really proud of me. She always says, she would always say, I remember it when I left, left to go out to school in the morning, she would rub my head and say, Love you, son. That, and I think that's important. I think that's what she was should be like just now. So cherish this day, guys. If you've got your mum and dad, and cherish your family. But I see tomorrow's never a given. Is it the same? Your mum is your best friend, and that's really, really true. And thank you very much for all your love and support. And I hope you've liked this little vlog. And happy Mother's Day to any you mothers that are out there as well. And I dare say that your family and that will be really, really blessed to have you and I, I, that's something that they should cherish as well. Binge on life, purge negativity and starve guilty feelings and be kind to every kind, the only difference is your perception. Speak to you all soon guys. <laughs>